Thank you. Well, you can tell with all the kids outside 7 on Main, right behind me in this shot, moms and dads are out of the park with them. And that tells you that families are starting to look for some alternative activities to keep all the kids entertained for their final week of winter break. And we've asked the YMCA of Greenville to join us because your local Y knows a lot about parents looking for options, right? You guys know that there's a need out there. There is definitely a need. Um, the parents uh, are, still have to work and the kids are out of school, so we have lots of activities for them to be, take a part of. Now, of course, it's best to plan these things in advance and to think about it a couple of weeks ahead of the Christmas break, but there is still an opportunity with some late fees to get in on the action this next week. Absolutely. So we still have space available on our December 30th and January 2nd and 3rd dates. If the parents want to spend some time away before they get back on their regularly scheduled programs, we have spots for their children available in our SOS and holiday camp. And so explain the difference, right? So you've got the, the camp experience and yes. then these sort of day activities. How, how do they work? Sure. So our holiday camps or spring break camps are for the extended weeks that Greenville County schools are out. And then we have an SOS days or schools out specials, which the teachers have teacher development work days. We are open for them for care, for full day care from 730 to 6 um, during those days. And so this is obviously going on next week, but it's also going on for all these other days that are coming up in the school year. So I think we have a, a listing of some of the dates where you have activities coming up. So if you want to plan ahead for the next big break, um, what, what are some of those dates that are coming up? Absolutely. So we are open um, on President's Day, um, spring break. We also have um, all the other teacher work days. You can check the Greenville County Schools calendar and all the days that they're off of school, we offer full day programming. And of course, you guys are in the Greenville County area. This is the Greenville right. County YMCA that we're talking mm -hmm. with, right? But there are other Ys around the region that also tend to offer programs like this. Maybe not the exact same dates, but you should check with your local Y if you're not in Greenville. Absolutely. Um, all Ys in the upstate offer um, schools out special programming. So just check your local Y to take part in those programs. And when it comes to pricing for something like this, if you're trying to budget or plan, as a parent, um, what what are the options? Absolutely. I mean, how, how expensive is it? Sure. So, if you're a member of the Y, it's thirty dollars per day. If you're a community member, it's forty-five dollars per day. And then we also offer financial assistance for anyone, so that financial barriers is not something that um, they are not able to partake in. And when it comes to the activities that you guys are, mm -hmm. are running, like what is it like? Like what's a sure. day like for one of these programs? Like a, a day-long program, sure. for example. Sure. Absolutely. So those days are themed, so it can be anything. If it's a President's Day, we'll be learning about presidents. We do art education, global education. We do safety around water and swimming. Sometimes we have field trips and guest speakers that come in. And then we always provide a healthy snack for them and health and wellness activities. Well, it looks like a lot of kids are looking for something to do, right? <laughs> Everyone's in the windows like having a great time today. Um, when it comes to the why and what they offer, mm -hmm. what, how, how do you feel about it in terms of how it differs from other options in the community. Absolutely. So at the Y, our mission states that we're for all. And so we accept everybody into our programs no matter where they come from. And I think that really sets us apart. I Also, our Christian mission sets us apart. So we're founded on Christian principles. And so everything that we do has that aspect within our programming, which sets us apart. And we're really proud of that history and our heritage. And if you look at like a week, like next week, for example, mm -hmm. how many kids will you guys wind up like having come through the various programs? Sure. So we might have anywhere, depending on the site and the location and the county that they're in, anywhere from 50 children to anywhere up to 200 children in those programs. Wow. Mm -hmm. And when it comes to where you're located, just mm -hmm. so people have a sense, mm -hmm. what key communities are you in? Sure. We're in our Traveler's Rest um, edu community. We're also downtown Greenville with our Kane Halter Y, Simpsonville, Eastside with our Greer and Taylor's area. So we're located all around Greenville County. So parents, if you're going stir crazy with the kiddos, you have no excuses now. The Y is ready to help you. Absolutely. And we appreciate you being here, helping Great. us understand what you have to offer. Thank you. You're welcome. Have a happy new year. You too. Thank you. And thanks for watching Carolina's Family at 4. We're coming right back with more.